Hello guys, uh, Nightwolf here, and today we're going to be playing one of my one of the games that is based on my favorite one of my favorite uh, movies called Scream. And yeah, I am wearing a Ghostface costume just to fit in with this uh, game. And yeah, before we play, uh, I'm gonna set off a warning that this will contain. This video will contain a lot of spoilers with from the movie itself. And, and yeah. before we start, I'm gonna ask you guys a very scary question. What's your favorite scary movie? Let's do it. Drag curse to look around. They said they meet, meet me here. Oh, hold on. Alright. Oh, okay. It's nice. Um, I think I'm here. This is so cool. Where are you? Um, I don't see you. It's ghost facing the house. This place is creepy. What room are you in? This is he better not have done have done anything with me friends. I wanna play a game. Yes, bring me on the, the trivia. Alright? If you answer correctly, you survive. If you don't, you die. It's very simple. Alright. Okay. Oh we got a timer. Um uh the Okay, uh, what do I do? Who gets stabbed to death to a roar of applause? Ring two. Derek? I'm sorry. What? The wrong answer. Oh. Um. Bedroom? Let's, yeah, let's, let's go to the bedroom. In Scream 2, Derek sings I Think I Love You to Sydney. Mickey says he is referring in which movie? Oh no, um, 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 um Top Gun? That's yes! Correct. Next question. Alright, alright. Top of the stairs. Um. That doesn't change the fact that you're stopping me, right? Uh, okay. There we go. In Scream 3, what's the name of Cotton Weir's iconic talk show? 100% Cotton. Correct. Now it's time for the bonus round. Alright. Alright, um. Let's go to dining room. Ah! Did I do something wrong? Of course I won't tell you. I could be anyone. I I've already watched the all this the five screen movies, so yeah. Stabbed in the back, crushed by the garage door, drowned in crushed by the garage door. Yeah. Looks like I have a fan. Next yep. question. <laughs> um, um dining room. Living room. Living room. Who can 
meal in the first screen. Um, John Carpenter. Wait, that was wrong. I'm sorry. That's the wrong answer. Oh. Oh. There are certain rules you must abide by in order to survive a horror movie. What's rule number one? Never drink or do drugs. You can never have sex. Never say I'll be right back. You can never have sex. Yeah, I remember all the rules. That's correct. Next question. Um, okay. Front entrance. What is the movie franchise about killings that occur in Woodsboro? Stab. It's iconic. Correct. Having fun. Let's try another one. All right. We go upstairs. Who met their demise in fire explosion that destroyed Jennifer Jolie's house in Scream Three? Ah, that was wrong. I'm sorry, that's the wrong answer. Okay. The bed the sign. Bed them again. Was it? Um. Yeah, you can't trick me. Yes. First scream, what movie do they watch at Stu Mopper's house? Nightmare on Elm Street, Evil Dead, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Halloween, Halloween. Yeah, I remember that scene. It's iconic. Yes, very good. Now for the real question. Okay. It seems so realistic though. Front entrance. Always the front entrance. You gotta be smart. Name Gail Weather's first book. What? I'm sorry. That's the wrong answer. Okay, 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 okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna gonna I'm gonna go dining room. This sucks. This sucks. Are the three movies based on a true story? No. No? I didn't know that. The kitchen, the, the front entrance, front entrance. Um, what do you do? What do you do? What is the name of Sydney Prescott's book recounting the Ghostface murders? Uh, out of Darkness. It's Out of Darkness, right? Very good. Let's keep going. All right. Wait. Hey, there's a mask in there. What famous horror heroine has an uncredited cameo as a news reporter in Scream? Uh, Halloween James. What? I'm sorry, that's the wrong answer. Oh. Uh, the kitchen, the kitchen, because there's a ghost face mask right there. Whoa! Ah! Oh! Ghostface got, got it you like a fish. Survival times. 7 minutes and 22 seconds. Oh. Uh. The questions in in this game are kind of like uh really hard. It's really hard to to answer them. And by the way, if you haven't watched Scream, I suggest you watch it now. So yeah, you can get the tickets when you play the game. By the way, if you want to play this the game like this, you could just uh, the link is in the description below. And yeah, that's basically it. I 
to be honest guys i i expected to be this i expected the questions to be really easy but nope i understand the perspectives of the victims in scream yep if you enjoy watching this video don't forget to like and subscribe and and yeah uh that's that's kind of it <laughs>